Y'all think I forgot? My tarot readings, my weekly horoscopes are only meant for people that are smiling. So if you're not smiling right now, honey. <laughs> I love you. Let's go. Hello, my beautiful Pisces. How are you doing? My name is Simply Velka, and today I'm going to be doing your weekly tarot horoscope reading. So if you find any cards that resonate with you in this reading, Pisces, let me know in the comments below which cards do and how they do, because that is how I keep up with y'all, is through the comments as well. If you do enjoy this tarot reading, Pisces, or you just enjoy my vibe, I would appreciate it if you were to give this video a like and subscribe, because it does help me out a lot, and I always am super appreciative of it. Uh, Pisces when you take that extra step to support me in that way um, but remember to use your intuition Pisces because put it in perspective just a man reading some tarot cards to you darling you know your situation better than I ever possibly could so take the cards that resonate and leave what doesn't because I'm not going to be offended by it whatsoever Pisces I promise you I believe my weekly readings my weekly tarot scopes are just here to give you some food for thought perspective for you to consider but never making the choice in your life because i believe it's your life to live not mine so now pisces with all that being said let's see what's going on uh in your life this week let's see where you guys are currently at in your path how is my pisces currently feeling page of water or the page of cups now pisces i know last week for y'all um there is like some type of energy that you wanted to open up to more something that you wanted to reach out to and i do feel like you're reaching out to them or you recently are or you're perhaps at the very least opening up to the idea of it uh pisces with this page of water here so i celebrate you for that darling it's showing to me that you guys were listening to my readings um or at the very least if this is the first time of you watching me pisces first of all let me know if you are a first time watcher in the comments because i would like to know um but yeah I'm just proud of you guys, Pisces, for, you know, uh, a lot, getting out of your head enough to allow yourself to uh, connect to other energies, right? Because I know for a little bit, Pisces, you guys have been in your head uh, dealing with a little bit of self-worth issues, dealing with a little bit of a writer's block, creator's block, almost. But it was almost formed because you were just in your head so much and because you guys, I feel like, were not uh, seeing y'all's value fully right so uh, let me read off this card this card says a new person enters your life a relationship begins a new phase and heightened psychic abilities so pisces yeah this is page of cups energy if you do not know what the page of water is it's cups is water is the water element or the water element is for cups you would know this pisces because you are a water sign so <laughs> i don't know why i'm like struggling explaining it so badly uh for you pisces but uh yeah let's continue on and see if we can get any more detail for this page of cups you know what are you opening what does this look like what does this page of cups look like that you're uh opening up to further right and this could be a completely new energy because page of cups page of water represents new energy but it also as if card reflects pisces just something that's current but you're beginning like a new phase like uh with the situation you're getting closer with somebody so let's see you have the page of cups now this card was in the reverse for you pisces so this is something yeah that you had was presented to you at one point or just was in your life for a while that it just took you a while to warm up to it to um you know perhaps some of your shyness to um be overcome we have the ten of pentacles coming in here as well as the world card coming in here so this is showing to me uh something that was already present in your life pisces this energy was already present and with this ten of pentacles in this world card it's showing to me um definitely i just feel inclined to say pisces some of y'all have definitely signed some contracts or like made things a little bit more official with somebody um so this is very much so perhaps some of y'all um have gotten into recently a new relationship is something i'm hearing especially with how this dynamic is you, some type of new phase with somebody or some opportunity is becoming right i know i'm speaking so much in terms of people pisces darling but remember i always say cups represent opportunities as well so it could be like a job opportunity right I, whatever it is it does feel like something that's new or the the very least um 
Yeah, I do feel like it just is something new, something that maybe not necessarily like the subject of the matter or like the uh, job description. Um, it just feels like you guys are leaning into it further and really um, starting your next phase with this, right? I do just definitely feel like Pisces, a lot of you guys just like... It's just very much so, let me just sum this up, right? Committed energies. You guys really committed your energy to something to begin a new cycle. Uh, the lover's card, yeah. Some of you Pisces, some of you guys, like, <laughs> this is definitely screaming like proposal marriage. Proposal marriage. This is definitely screaming like a proposal or some type of marriage, especially with this Ten of Pentacles, Pisces. Like, someone's getting married, darling. Someone's getting proposed to. Someone's getting married. Someone's getting into a relationship. Someone is, um, definitely for sure, someone's making big decisions. Um, definitely some of you guys, Pisces, have, like, signed into, like, assigned a contract to a new apartment. You get the vibe, right? Like, you, what I'm trying to say, some of you guys opened up to this new work opportunity, right? Definitely I'm seeing contracts, some, someone writing down a contract in collaboration as well. Um, just especially from last week. Whatever it is, it's extremely profitable. It's very much so like a celebration for you guys, Pisces. So, congratulations, darling. Let me know what happens. Let me know the tea in the comments. Oh my gosh, Pisces, y'all didn't see it, but I just had a bunch of cards, honey, fall down that I have to get. And I don't even, like, the worst part is, Pisces, is I don't even think these are cards that are, like, for you. In fact, I know they're not for you. They're just, they're just cards that fell down because I can't manage these cards somehow. <laughs> I think I got them all down. So let's go into this a little bit deeper, Pisces. How is this going to turn out for you this week? How is this going to continue on? Right. So we have the Eight of Cups in the reverse. So this isn't anything new, Pisces. This isn't anything new uh, for you. This is something you've had your eye on. This is something that's... Um, it does feel like you're just allowing yourself to being more present with the opportunity more. Um, being more present and just no longer running away from things or shying away from things anymore. It's now like a situation, Pisces, where it's like if someone offers you um, a piece of candy, like as an example, and like you're sitting there hungry, right? You're going to just take the candy rather than being shy and be like, oh, no, thank you. I don't want, I'm not thirsty, right? You're not going to be embarrassed about accepting whatever is presented to you, especially if it's a proposal, darling. Like, hello? If I hear any of my uh, Pisces denying a proposal just because of their own insecurity, I don't even want, we, we're not even going to entertain that Pisces, hello? empress card yeah this is such a like pisces i know this is such a like <laughs> and i always try my best to stray away from those type of readings just because it's just like girl come on but like truly this is such a dramatic week for you guys in the sense that like like this is usually like a card for tarot like a birth announcement like pisces something major is happening in your life this week <laughs> Something major, something major, Ace of Wands coming in as well. Something major is happening this week. Uh, I don't even know how I'm going to title this video for you, Pisces, because it's just like, it feels like a lot of good is just opening up to you. And I do, again, just feel like this good is just opening up to you, like this good is happening because you're just opening up to things now. You're just allowing uh, situations to just happen for you and just accepting them, accepting them pisces like this is just beautiful right there's some type of big announcement that's happening straight up wheel of fortune come on now and the hermit card in the reverse things are starting to uh, open up pisces and it's directly related to you finally breaking out of your shell um finally you just um how would we say just like you know, allowing yourself to create, right? I know from last week, Pisces, I was chastising some of you guys on your perfectionism and really not wanting to, like, you guys not wanting to put your stuff out there because, like, you know, some of you Pisces needed to be reminded that just because it's not your best doesn't mean it's not worth being posted, right? I was really harping on you guys and letting you know, Pisces, it was like, no, like, post that stuff, honey. Like, you want to have your stuff be seen just because it's not your best, it's still worth being seen. It's still good enough to be seen seen you guys were just needing to work on your own how you were viewing your uh viewing yourself and how what things you were personally internalizing and um 
yeah, I just see you guys finally working on it and just opening up to things. Seven of Swords in the reverse. You're just trusting the situation more. Yeah, truly, Pisces, this is just a week of just straight up. Do not, you know, <laughs> obviously with discretion, darling. But this is really a good week, Pisces, of just like anything new coming into your life this week just confidently openly receive it this is such a really good week for you pisces to just be receiving good things right and i think you guys even need to tell yourself that be you remind yourself that you are worth having good things happen happening to you right you guys pisces are my zodiac sign um and i mean this in the best way pisces i say it with peace and love right truly um but you guys are like my uh out of like my 12 zodiac signs and i see i feel you guys pisces as like the runt of the litter uh not because like y'all are like any lesser or anything like that but i feel like my pisces are like my most sensitive my most who need to have like this reassurance because they just do not see how lovely they are you pisces as well as my aquariuses y'all are like my little um my little runts of the litter and i always say that with peace and love because it's just like every other all the other signs you know some of them are a little bit too cocky darling but um <laughs> playing but uh yeah you guys pisces really struggle with like self-image issues um so i feel like i always have to be a little bit more um forward with what it is because right because i don't feel like you guys either either you guys don't hear a lot of good things like a lot of positive affirmations towards you or you guys are just really uh, critical of y'all selves so i have to like counteract that right so pisces let's see what, what good things are happening to you this week what good things are on the way granted darling even with that first general spread there we have plenty of good things already talked about for you but um, what, actually, yeah, let's see what ignore that. Let's see what advice that we can get for you, Pisces, other than the obvious of just like getting out of your head, right? <laughs> we have the two of fire coming in here. Definitely, this is all talk about long term, darling. Uh, this card says, you know, like, come on, come on now, Pisces. This card says you've come into your own new partnerships or contracts and continue moving forward. Pisces, come on now. Come on now, Pisces, come on now. Let's get some more detail with this, but this is just straight up like, as I was saying before, definitely confidently accept things coming to you this week. I do definitely see things opening up to you, Pisces. And it's very much so reflective, reflective of the phrase, Pisces, uh, life opens up when you do. Uh, very much so that energy. So, get a little bit more clarifiers. Three of Wands coming in here. Yeah, you see, you're definitely going to be seeing some signs this week, Pisces, of where it is you need to go. So definitely pay attention to that, right? Queen of Pentacles in the reverse, all right? With the Six of Wands. So directly, uh, Pisces, like this is probably like my most positive reading in the longest time. Um, <laughs> uh for not just you guys pisces but just in general this is arguably i would say this is probably like my best reading i've ever had for my zodiac sign for my weekly horoscopes um because this is very much so like a situation of where it's like like i've just never had such a dynamic uh pisces of where it's like quite literally the worst thing you can do at this time is doubting yourself like quite literally like the more you just like allow yourself to create the more you just open up to things more the more you just like i don't know just like <laughs> the less you resist things the less that you what have you the more success that comes to you right the six of wands is the card of victory success spotlight right like i feel like you guys are definitely going to be noticed this week like whatever it is whether it's like a pregnancy darling whether it's like a, something like even like contract like as like the two of wands says like contracts but like continue move like quite literally i see it just is all encompassing like something huge but in a beautiful way is happening in your life and it just makes you really happy for you so definitely share the good news of what's going on pisces as the week goes on in the comments below because um, i want to celebrate with you of course so now pisces let's see what's going on for y'all for your uh um 
why can I not speak Pisces <laughs> romantic and social connections this week because keep in mind Pisces we have more than just love in our life we have uh, friendships co-workers family we have all sorts of relationships in our life it doesn't always have to be romantic right let's see what's going on there for you this week we have the knight of pentacles coming in here time to buckle down and get things done honor your commitments and a guardian angel coming in pisces so yeah definitely going into like treading into new territory when it comes to some type of social dynamic definitely reflective of um reflective of uh what will what, is, what are we trying to say pisces reflective of the general reading there we go <laughs> so let's get a little bit more clarification for this see what's going on we have the hierophant in the reverse coming in here all right we have the three of pentacles this is definitely like whatever it is pisces this is definitely a situation that was in your life beforehand and the world card you guys are beginning like a different phase with them that's just something I'm getting so strongly from before. Like, I don't know if you guys before, like, like, I feel like there's just like initially like distance initially, like there is just no communication. Um, I feel like there's communication now because it's under this night of uh, earth energy or this night of pentacles energy, Pisces. Um, I do definitely feel like this is because like some type of energy was just a little bit, it took a little bit longer to warm up to, right? Someone had to break out of their shell. Someone had to get over their shyness. This is not shyness, you darling. But um, definitely you have another car contracts card, right? Three of pentacles. Uh, the hierophant even talks about higher commitment. Um, when I see this in the reverse in this dynamic, because it's right across the world card as well, um, I do feel like, again, it's just like uh, something that you weren't initially committed to, you guys are engaging with now. Um, you guys are just opening up to a lot more. So that makes me extremely happy for you, uh, Pisces. Extremely, extremely happy for you. So now, Pisces, let's now get into your... Uh, financial as well as your career situation this week let's see what's going on there for y'all this week and let's see what's in the works for your financial and career let's see here all right pisces so we have the seven of earth all right very good seven of uh, pentacles uh this is a card that says seeds well planted a temporary pause in action unnecessary worry darling so some of you guys pisces are starting to have a little bit of insecurity in terms of the things that you're putting energy into the stocks that you've invested into darling the job that you've been like there's just some type of like you know fear and almost like this obsessive nature of perhaps for you Pisces of wondering if you're making the right choice, right? Because two of pentacles, two of wands tried to come out at the bottom of the deck. So I do definitely feel like you guys are trying to weigh out. It's just like, okay, well, like what is going to serve me best in the long term? What is like thinking long term? Like what is going to be the most profitable, right? It's almost like you're getting in your head about the crops that you planted, the seeds that you planted and be like, I don't know. And like you yourself are wondering Pisces and just being unsure about if you made the right choice or if it's just uh if you should switch things up right so let's see here let's get some more clarifiers for this pisces page of pentacles coming in here four of pentacles my investment card hello all pentacle energy notice nine of cups so even though you have some anxiety about uh something in like your financial your work life this week pisces you're definitely going to be receiving a very good sign and it's probably going to be through some type of communication good sign somehow a person that's associated with this i feel especially with this nine of cups and this page of pentacles there's definitely some line of communication some type of energetic exchange opening up i feel like coming in here something being offered right and then with this four of pentacles is showing up as well whatever is offered this is more so like investment energies something that you've already put a lot of time energy and energy into even if you like like were emotionally invested into like you know i mean you get the point pisces it does just feel like whatever you were putting all your ducks in right whatever you were making almost like a gamble with it's going to pay out so uh yeah straight up pisces notice how like your entire reading was just an extremely positive one in all fronts like really the only thing i could say for y'all pisces is just to really 
getting out of your head and just opening up because i truly feel like that's like the number one thing is just like like the more you open up the more the universe responds to that and opens up even further for you like it's very much so like a uh, it's just beautiful Pisces <laughs> like and I know I always uh, will like push this for my Pisces like not just for you Pisces but just my zodiac signs in general I've always just telling them to not be afraid of taking action but straight up this week Pisces you it's like nothing but beauty and abundance in all fronts the stuff that you guys have been trying to manifest Pisces it's coming into fruition darling trust and believe like a lot of good things are happening for you Pisces and so just realize your worth and realize that these good things are meant for you and it's okay to be happy about it and to receive it fully because you deserve it right you deserve it you've been working so hard pisces so that is the cards that i have for you this week pisces i love you so much if you enjoyed this tarot reading be sure to let me know in the comments below uh be sure to give this video a like if you and subscribe if you did enjoy this reading uh pisces also i do zodiac readings for all the zodiac signs not just yours so if you have a friend that's into weekly tarot readings or even if they're not send them one of my videos and maybe they'll find a tarot message that resonates with them pisces if you're interested in booking a personal reading with me i have my personal website down below all my social medias instagram twitter tiktok honey everything facebook it's all just simply velka i like to keep it simple of course right but i love you so much pisces and i hope i can connect with you sometime in the near future i love you so much